Hello there ladies and gentlemen of the internet, Crawling UK here with part 3 of my second Densetsu play which is just to show you the gameplay of each of the three games. So this time we'll be looking at Secret of Mana 2, known in Japan as Seiken Densetsu 3. We're we'll going to get straight into that and have a look at it now. So I'll have a quick look at the borders because I know on the previous one there was only two. So that's the zoomed out one. You can see the background picture there. Some sort of volcano, some mountains. And then that's the zoomed in one. Okay. So we're starting a new game. Continue. So with this one I have to choose, I think, three heroes out of these six here. So, choose one. Uh, I think I can see there they've already got a name. So uh, I chose uh, Risu and then this is uh, Jiran. And then we'll go for this one. Angela. Oh, Angela. Okay, so I've never played this one before. Besides from a small portion, which was translated into English in the early 2000s, and I played that on like a PC emulator or something. But uh, at the time, I always struggled to enjoy. Super Nintendo games on the PC, especially as I I just bought them. It was just so overwhelming that you could get so many games. I enjoyed buying them, so that's why I've got this one as well. <laughs> so let's see what happens here. Oops. Getting battered here. <laughs> So it doesn't seem as like like there's any 100% gauge anymore, we just hit them. And so far I've got 3 out of 4 bars at the bottom, and now I've got 4. And that's when I can press B and do a special attack. Missed with the special. <laughs> Imagine game over at this point, that wouldn't be very good. Get him. Yes, special attack. And it didn't defeat him. What's this spell? God, it's a hard one. I'm trying to defeat the. Uh, oh! That was close. <laughs> Either it was uh, meant to happen that I lose that much energy or it was very close. So they seem to be either thinking or talking there about something. Some sort of overview preview of the game here. <laughs> there we 
we're up back at the castle, I guess that's a good thing. Run up and speak to the king. Skip through this text here. That's me done with at that point. Oh, I should have gone through all the side doors and knew it. <clears throat> These ones here. Yep, there we are. That should take me out. But I can't get out of the castle yet. <laughs> But anyway, I just wanted to show you the gameplay. It is very similar to that of Secret of Man. There is a different... I don't even if I should say it's a different battle system. It's very uh, similar in many ways, but there is the... Um, the attacking mechanic, if you like. This is the menu screen, which is very different. It doesn't give up the ring menu anymore. So it's not fast, fast equips, um, but you can see there in the bottom, where is that bottom right, sorry, uh, you press up to go to your inventory, you can look at your windows by pressing right, uh, left, go to the right to look at your equip menu, uh, battle tactics, uh, magic, statistics, file for saving, I don't think you can save it from there. Um, so that, that's a big change from Secret of Mana. Because you have the fast equipping, you can press the Y button, come up with the ring and you can change your weapon quite quickly. And yeah, so I was saying about the battle before, that with Secret of Mana you got like an ability at the beginning where you could hold the attack button and lash out with a stronger attack. This one is more where you've got to get kind of four bars up and then you attack, which will give you the uh, special attack. But that's about it. Apart from that, it's uh, a good secret amount of game. But there isn't much for me to sh show you apart from this about this game. This, there is no English option, so you won't be able to understand it if you don't know any Japanese but all the like at the bottom there you can see I've got 2 out of 87 energy you can see I've got 9 MP the, these things are kind of straightforward so you could have some fun with just the gameplay alone providing in an area like this that you know where you're going next uh, for me just now, I'm just exploring the castle. I know there's someone I'm supposed to speak to, but I can't remember where it was. But this is probably the best place to end the video for now. Eh? If you've enjoyed it, give us a thumbs up. If, uh, if you haven't done already, subscribe to my channel. This helps me out tremendously as always. It's uh, good for me. <laughs> but as always, thank you very much for watching. Bye.